Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Just Kidding, the dancing Avon lady. So today we're doing a swatch review video on Avon's birthday balm. As you can see, I do have three different shades for you. I don't know if you guys heard of the My Lips But Better trend that they have, where it's looking for that nude lip. And it might not even be a trend, but it's something that we're always out to look for, at least I've been out to look for, haven't quite found it yet. I think it's one of those lip products that you can put on without a mirror, kind of like lip balm, but it kind of gives a little bit more intensity to your natural lip color. So this, I think, is supposed to deliver that. The Birthday Balm Lip Crayons, and I think it's called Birthday Balm because it is supposed to be that really natural nude color. Avon describes it as a butter soft balm with sheer hint of color and shine for your best nude lip ever. So yes, that's awesome. The marketing of it is awesome absolutely adorable it has like a cake and these look like little candles sticking out of it oh my gosh it is absolutely ridiculously adorable it is formulated with non-gmo shea butter and um, it's free of mineral oils parabens phthalates and also gluten free it's supposed to be a lip enhancing nude shade that complements all skin tones plus the lip crayons are perfectly portable perfect for touch-ups and they never need to be sharpened so i'm going to assume because of that it's they're going to be like the twist kind of like our glimmer sticks shea butter is good for your skin because it's very high in fatty acids it's also very high in vitamins but in addition to that shea butter also has anti-inflammatory and healing properties so it's supposed to be another one of those products that it's cosmetic but it's also good for you yes great dual purpose love my dual purpose products the use of shea butter can condition tone and soothe your skin and i mean we all know that our lips are very sensitive and they need to be conditioned and loved a lot I love my lip products. I love my lip products. You guys know that. Um, in addition to the shea butter, um, this pro the birthday balm is also formulated with caprylic triglycerides. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right, which is uh, usually derived from coconut oil, and it is a more natural alternative to synthetic chemicals that are often found in makeup and skin products it's an ingredient that's used often in soaps and cosmetics the benefit it is that it's a product that is it's clear um, and has slightly sweet to the taste interesting so i'm wondering if this is gonna have a little bit of taste to it so it has antioxidants and it softens your skin the caprylic triglyceride helps to trap moisture in your skin so it kind of creates like a shield and so that it provides a protective layer so that the moisture can't escape out of your lip. Ooh, it says that according to the website, it's also, it's an effective as a skin softening ingredient. Mmm. All right, cool. It's supposed to also mix together well with pigments and scents. Uh, not, I don't know if this has any scent. I haven't, obviously, as always, guys, I haven't opened it at all. The antioxidants in this also um, works to neutralize the toxins that we are exposed to every day through pollutions, free radicals, sun exposure, um, which can pr uh, pretty much like age our skin, like prematurely age our skin, cause wrinkles, fine lines. Ooh, it says that a caprylic triglycerides is full of the antioxidants, which help to preserve your skin and help you feel younger. So with this, I am looking forward to moisturization, antioxidants, younger looking lips, and for it just to be really darn cute. So this is going to be launched in campaign 15 and it's going to be available in six different shades. I got the darkest one, which is the fine wine. And also I thought I got, yeah, and I got the lightest one as well, which is the loving life. So I have not the full colors guys because I didn't buy all six, but I got like the darkest, not quite as dark and also the lightest one. Let's open it up. I'm going to go from the lightest to darkest. I think that would be the best way to go. So I'm going to start off with Loving Life. I got Birthday Suit and I also got Fine Wine. I'm going to swatch it for you first and then afterwards, it's going on my lips. Here we go. Ooh, how sleek. Look how sleek and shiny that is. I like the shape of the tip. It really does look like a crayon, guys. It's really cute really really cute this is the birthday balm in love and life and it looks really sweet and pretty so let's check this one out ah! oh there we go pull cap pull cap you just gotta pull a little harder yeah i don't smell anything nothing this is the loving life oh it oh it's so soft guys it's super buttery super buttery it's a very pale pink might be a bit pale for me. If you're looking for your natural nude lip, the really great way is to match it to the inside of your lip color. 
when you when you're testing this a good way to test it is on your fingertips so instead of testing on the back of your hand or even on your wrist like i'm doing right now a great place is just to test it on your fingertips like that and this is going to be a little light i think but i love the texture it's literally like butter so that is the birthday balm in love and life next shade will be the birthday suit this is slightly darker than loving life i wonder how they come up the names with these oh pretty young thing ha huh? you guys know pretty young thing da -da -na 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 -na. mj mj guys okay Ooh, ooh, i like this one even more okay Ooh, i like this color okay so this one is birthday suit see, see the twist that's cool all right so here is the birthday suit one oh that's so pretty that one's gonna be really nice let's check on my fingertip yeah oh i love it i love this one i think i'm really gonna like this one gorgeous 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 and then finally the fine wine i miss wine Ooh, how beautiful is this one never be afraid of purples guys okay you can do so much with purples what before like a couple years ago i was like no i will never use a purple lipstick oh my god i love purple lipstick you can do so much with it it's really flattering oh come on okay if you twist and wiggle it i think it's coming off a little bit easier i just don't want to smudge the tip here is the birthday balm in fine wine Oh, now let's try it on my fingertip. Yeah, so this is definitely not my natural shade color, but I think I'm really going to like it. Really, really going to like it. These are the three colors that I got. All right, so now let's test these out on my lip. I'm going to start off with the lightest color and then move upwards. So first one we're going to do is the Loving Life, which is what I swatched earlier. That's this one here. This is my natural lip color. And let's give this a go. I'm just going to do my bottom lip first. Ooh, okay. It's kind of frosty. I think it's because it's pale. It kind of reminds me of our twinkle pink that we have. It's a bit light, but there's a time and place for this look. It goes on so buttery, guys. Oh my God, it's like insanely buttery. This is Love and Life Naked Top. Okay, so let's do the full thing. I can't get over how silky this is. Ready for a taste test? Now, not sweet. I don't taste anything. I was kind of hopeful that it had a slightly sweet taste, but then again, I would lick my lips, which is also bad. Don't lick your lips. It's not good for your lips. It is too light for me, but it's a really pretty color. We can work with this. I can play around with this to make this a lip look. But is this my... My lips by better shade. No, it's not my perfect nude lips, but it's a really pretty color. This is not going to be transfer free. It is a balm. It's not going to be something that's going to last all day either, but it is really, really, really hydrating. Let's wipe this off. Let's go to the next one. Lips are naked again. So now we're going to test out the birthday suit. I think I'm really going to like this one. So the birthday suit, it looks like it has like a little bit of a rose shade to it, which is really pretty. Okay. Bottom lip has the birthday suit. Top lip is naked. Ooh. Is this it, guys? Is this it? Oh my god. Did I find it? <gasps> I think I might have found it. Arrgh! Okay. Let's try the top. Is this it? I think this might be it. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. This, I think, is my, my lips, but better that I have been on searching for for months now. I think I found it. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <gasps> it's so pretty. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. <gasps> yeah. Okay. 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 I think this is it. I think this is it. Guys, let me know in the comments below. Do you like it with the side light on or the side light off? I can never tell. Never tell. You guys let me know what you think. But oh my gosh, I love this. I love this color. <gasps> oh my gosh, this might be my new go-to color. It's like that little hint of color. It just adds a little bit of intensity to my lip color. Oh my gosh, I love it. And it feels so good. Okay, I want to do a transfer test for you guys, just so you guys can see. 
Oh, okay. Once again, this is the birthday suit one that I'm really happy. It's like my birthday suit. Okay, here you go. Yeah, you can definitely see it. It's not going to be transfer free, guys. But at least, hey, now you know. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy when you find that product you've been looking for. I even like how it's hugging the edge of my lips. I like how it's hugging that. Happy, Jesse! Yay! I refer to myself in third person. Yes, I know. It's rarely weird. It's just a thing I do, but I'm happy. Okay, let's finish this up. Here's my third one and final one that I am testing out for you guys today, which is the fine wine. This one, I think it's going to be a little bit more intense, but it's going to be great, especially for those days that you just have to quickly jump on to a video conference and you just need a really easy pop of color. So here it goes. Mm, I'm still... I'm st Still flying high from like finding that birthday suit color. Here is this is the darkest one that they have. Natural lip, fine wine. All right, now let's do the full shade. I love the texture of this, guys. I can't get over the texture. I like the amount of shine too. It's not like too much, but it's enough to kind of hide hide some of my imperfections of my lips not imperfections but my life hide some of the lines of my lips really this is a really pretty color too out of all of them my favorite obviously is the birthday suit and then followed by this one this one is just it's just a little bit too light but i mean i love these two i can probably still do something with it i'll, I'll think about it i just do have a lot of a lot of lip product right now because i've been testing so many different things i love the texture of it that's one of my favorite things about this it's the texture of it so let's say if you want something that will last longer throughout the day so you always have some color on your lips something that i have been doing is i've been staining my lips with a long lasting lipstick and then applying a balm on top of it i've done that with a couple different looks and i've gotten like lots of great compliments with it so one of them that i've been using this one here the mattitude because it lasts so long and i would just kind of tap it in and then add my my um like well actually i did the other way around i would use my lip color and then tap tap it tap in the mattitude another one i would do is i would line and fill my lips with our two-in-one lip tattoo and then put on a balm that's like the closest to it and then i get that really nice slight shine and also I would still get um, the moisturizing effect from my balm, but I have the intensity of color that I was looking for to last me the day so I don't have to worry if I need to jump onto a quick conference or something. Oh my gosh, okay loving these do recommend you try it if you don't know which is your best shade i reckon always recommend my clients to get two shades um and then either you can you have an extra one that you can play with or you can return the one that you don't want because avon does have a really great return policy where they will take back a product that you've opened and tried uh, not to resell of course but they're willing to issue exchanges and refunds so yeah i do recommend getting these they're really fun to use and they're just really cute they are really cute and i love the fact that it's twists kind of like a marriage between a lip balm and a lipstick so this is a lip balm lipstick baby yes let's go with that oh my gosh i am head over heels in love especially with this one here this one is gorgeous and i'm so happy that we have a lip crayon again we had lip crayon something like two years ago and um, after they discontinued it i had some customers who were very sad because they loved the convenience of a lip crayon and they love the precision of a lip crayon as well so I'm excited to be able to share this with them. I love the shades. I love the fact that there are six different ones that you can play around with. Yeah, and it's just really, it's really easy to use. And if you find your perfect one, you don't even have to worry too much about having a mirror there to do it. You can just kind of get it done. Yeah, but for the darker one like this, I would use a mirror to make sure that I don't like sloop sloop. You know what I mean? The other thing that I really love about it is that it's one of those products that's good for you. It's good for you and it looks good. But I'm just really excited because Avon has been coming up with all these great products that I still have a huge list of items that I need to share with you guys. And I just need to find the time to do so. So anyways, usually on Instagram, guys, I, Instagram and Facebook, I do have more of the um, real-time product trying simply because... 
I, it's less work to edit. But if you guys are interested on Facebook, I have started a Facebook group called The Dancing Avon Lady where we chat about beauty, makeup trends, and all that good stuff. If you want, find me there, join it, and say hi. And same thing with Instagram, guys. So thank you so much for joining me on this video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you do give this video a big fat thumbs up. Just let me know that you enjoyed it so I can keep making these type of videos for you guys. If you want to see the full collection of this birthday bomb or if you want to read up a little bit more about it, make sure you do click my Easter link down below and while you're there check out that join Avon button have you ever considered becoming an Avon beauty ambassador basically playing with makeup talking about it and generating sales from your free online store it is free to join Avon and you can start up your own online business with zero monetary investment I will be here to mentor you along the way if you guys are new to this channel make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification I have new videos up at least I try to have new videos up every single week and and the odd time I do have a second video guys so mm, you never want to miss one of those I love you guys I'll see you guys in the next one bye I can't say that